Catholic high school tennis coach charged in a hit and run crash that killed a teen jogger. Good evening, I'm Lindsay Pena. And I'm Steve Atkinson. Leilani Magno was struck by an SUV while jogging along a sidewalk in Chula Vista earlier this month. George Espinosa turned himself in the very next day. And new at five, our tenders reporter Steve Fiorina joins us on this story. Steve, it got emotional inside the courtroom. Certainly did. Uh, the object of all this, that very popular young girl who was sh uh, killed last week in such a tragic accident. Today, the uh, suspect, he had tears as well as her family. There are many pictures of a smiling Leilani Magno, killed by a hit and run driver just weeks before her 18th birthday. She was a wonderful young girl. Um, she loved Harry Potter. Um, she had big plans. She just finished her, um, her high school with honors. She was an athlete. She was very involved in her community. George Espinosa was arraigned on felony, hit and run, and misdemeanor involuntary vehicular manslaughter charges. His face was ordered electronically blurred because there may be identification issues. A tennis coach at Modern Day High School and at the East Lake Country Club, Espinosa was sobbing as his attorney told the court of his support from those he had worked with. 15 letters sent to the judge. Afterward, though, Leilani's uncle questioned the man's character. I understand that accidents do happen. Well, what kind of a person will hit somebody, run them over, and instead of stopping and calling 911 or providing CPR and first aid, will just take off? It was over 24 hours later that Espinosa contacted authorities, and family members of the victim have asked if there's any evidence of impaired driving. The DA says the investigation continues with two charges as of now, which could lead to five years in prison if he's convicted. Hit and run resulting in death as well as the involuntary manslaughter. Of course, if anything comes out during the course of the ongoing investigation, we will amend the charges accordingly. Judge Kerry Katz raised bail to $100,000 and ordered Espinosa not to drive and he would be under house arrest if he makes bail. There is a celebration of life planned for Leilani tonight. We will share that at 7. Live in Chula Vista, Steve Fiorina, 10 News.